Good morning vlog. It's currently 4.45 and I'm about to get up and start the day. <laughs> It's about 5 a.m. now, but it was 4.30 when I woke up. Today, I'm gonna be bringing you guys with me on a little morning routine in my life. I have to speak kind of quietly because my sweet mates are obviously all still sleeping and I don't wanna wake them up. I literally don't know why I could not sleep last night. I woke up at 2.30 and was tossing and turning. And then by the time it got to be 4.30, I was like, you know what? Let's get up, let's do this thing. And I'm just gonna make it into a morning routine. I do not get up at 4.30, like, ever. Like, I don't remember the last time I got up this early, but I thought might as well put it to good use and make a video out of it. So we're gonna be super, super productive this morning. I already brushed my teeth, made my bed, stretched, which are all things I do normally. And I am gonna head to the gym. The gym opens at 6 a.m. So I have about 50-ish minutes. So I'm gonna go ahead and get dressed, make something small and quick to eat before I go. And then we are gonna head to the gym and hit legs. So I'm gonna bring you guys along for that workout. And then I'll come back, shower, and just get ready for the day. So I hope you guys enjoy this little morning routine in my life, super early. I know I'm gonna crash later, but we're gonna be productive for now. Also, one last thing before we go ahead and jump in. I'm filming on my camera right now, so I know the quality is not the, as good as my normal videos, but that's because my Canon G7X broke and it's currently getting fixed. For the time being, we're just gonna be vlogging on the phone, which I know is very unfortunate, but that's what we're doing. So with all that being said, let's get into this video and let's go to the gym. Okay, so here is today's little gym fit. I'm wearing some royal blue shorts from Amazon. And then this top I just got from my best friend Eileen for my birthday and it's from Fabletics. So I'm not gonna bother doing my makeup or washing my face or anything like that until I get back from the gym because I'm gonna do all that after I get sweaty and once I take a shower and everything. So now that I'm all suited up for the gym, I am gonna go make some breakfast. It is very early for breakfast. I don't normally eat breakfast until like 9, 9.30. So the fact that I'm eating at what? 5.15 is a little bit crazy, but I definitely don't like to work out on an empty stomach. So I think I'm gonna go make some eggs because that's what I always have for breakfast. <music> I just finished making my breakfast. It is basically my daily egg scramble. If you guys have watched any of my full day of eatings, y'all know I love my egg scrambles. Essentially, it's just two eggs, peppers, some greens, half of a turkey patty, a bunch of different seasonings, salt, pepper, garlic, and then everything bagel seasoning, of course. And it's so yummy. And then of course, ketchup as well. So I'm just going to eat this and it's about 5.30 right now. So once I finish, I'll probably head over to the gym because the gym that I have to go to is the student rec center today instead of Rams, which is the one that's closer to me on South Campus. So it's gonna be a little bit extra of a walk. Rams doesn't open till nine and I wanna go to the gym obviously earlier than that. Also, while I eat this in my room, I'm gonna sip on this coffee that I got yesterday from Port City Java. 
Port City Java is literally one of my favorite coffee places of all time. And yes, it's a little watered down, but I think the espresso is much needed today because obviously we woke up early. We're munching, but yeah. Day old coffee. It's actually not as bad as you would think. Don't think I'm ready for you. Don't think you're ready for me either. I know you've been with her too long. It's okay, I'm just saying. What if she told you that she still likes you and she wants? All right, you guys. So I am at the gym now. I'm currently in the little Tar Heel Training Center. So this is actually the little space that personal trainers at UNC get to use. And we get to work out in here when no trainers are training clients. And it's 6 a.m. and it's the second week of school. And yeah, no one's in here. So that is perfect. Like I mentioned, I'm gonna hit a leg day today and I'll just bring you guys along for it. I'm definitely planning on doing like a full week of workouts like at some point soon. So keep your eyes peeled for that. Every summer, every winter, or every season, I'll be missing her. No matter how much time goes by, my love for her will never die. Many I've been wondering why goodbyes can be the sweet, yet we still cry. With all the wind goes our mistakes, my love for her will never change. The ghetto greeter, Magato. Y'all, I just finished doing those step ups. They literally kill me every single time. My booty cheeks are on fire. Now we're gonna head over to the Smith Machine again to do some good mornings. I try, but I can't get you out of my mind. Nasashi de no maraconia. Yosari chica. Every summer, every winter, or every season. I just finished my workout and I'm heading back to my apartment now. It was about an hour and a half ish. I feel like I'm definitely gonna be sore tomorrow. I'll update you guys more when I am back at my apartment. So I'm back from the gym now. Before I hop in the shower, do my skincare, and get all ready for the day, I want to quickly talk to you guys about my workout. The workout that I just showed you guys has been the leg day that I've been doing for most of the summer because it is a leg day that I could do when I couldn't use my wrist as much and also whenever I was working out at my neighborhood gym that didn't have very much equipment and so I'm, I've just kind of gotten in that routine. If you guys have been watching my videos for a while you know that like I used to be really into heavy strength training. I would do it almost every single day and I haven't really been doing that recently. My Monday leg days are really the only day that I lift super heavy anymore. And the main reason is honestly just to make sure that I'm not losing too much muscle mass, especially on my legs and glutes because I have worked those muscles for so long to grow them to just stop training them all together and to see that muscle loss would be really disappointing for me. That's the, honestly the main reason is just to make sure that I am maintaining the muscles there. I used to be really structured with my leg days as well. I would go in with a specific plan. I would plan to progressive overload, push really hard, go crazy, like 
all this and I really don't do that anymore. I kind of just do what I want to and I feel like that takes a lot of the stress and pressure off of my workouts because I used to get so anxious and like feel like I needed every single workout to be 10 out of 10 or it just like would suck and I've kind of realized that like I don't have to push that hard I'm gonna push hard but I'm not gonna like kill myself in the gym and that's okay and with my goals changing as well um, I just wasn't happy with all of that being said I am really happy I worked out this morning it's about 8 30 now and I'm about to hop in the shower and then I'm gonna do my skincare and all that when I get out and then do my makeup and start on work for today like I literally normally am like just getting up or you know getting ready at 8 30 so like the fact that I already worked out ate breakfast like feeling pretty good guys can't say that this is going to become a routine but definitely is nice anyways let's go get unsweaty never met someone like you uh, felt something like your touch I wish we would have met tonight sure I've had sitting at my desk here and I'm about to start on my makeup. I am not going to do a full get ready with me because I just filmed one of those a few days ago which was my get ready with me for the first day of school video. So if you want to see an entire get ready with me, go watch that video. Alright guys, so I just finished up my makeup. Gotta take out my little hair clips. Alright, so I feel like Pretty much almost done i have one more thing so one of my best friends just gave me this summer fridays it is a lip butter balm and i want to try it on it smells so good it smells like pink sugar apparently okay period so now that makeup is all done and outfit is on which i'll show you guys in a second basically all that i really have left to do this morning is do some work on my computer i want to get ahead and start editing videos because i have my day in my life vlog i have my week in my life vlog now i'm gonna have this vlog so i have a lot of content to edit for you guys which i adore i freaking am like obsessed with like editing and making videos recently guys so i realized that while i was editing this video i totally forgot to include any type of outro it literally just cut from me doing some work and editing to nothing so here's the outro thank you guys so so much for coming with me on this 4 30 a.m morning routine like i said in this video i definitely did not make this a routine per se this was kind of just a random morning in my life but i hope that it motivated you guys to get up early be productive, start your day off with some movement. Definitely feel free to subscribe for more videos. I have lots more college content, fitness, lifestyle, all of that good stuff. Feel free to follow all my socials, which I will put there, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Yeah.